So back when I was planning all these podcasts and all these sort of uh, YouTube projects, I spoke to Hasib and he goes, why don't we do like an, an interview with random people going past? And come on, do you know when someone says, excuse me, what's the first thing that comes to your mind? No, I'm busy, isn't it? Like people giving out even free newspaper when when they're giving out free newspaper you say no no thanks not interested I mean that's what I do anyway and like when someone has that you know that clipboard in their hand has that iPad in their hand and go excuse me massive smile sales you know top to bottom pristine clothing excuse me mate can I ask you something he like no no and then they say whatever they say it doesn't matter can I borrow you for something uh, one guy <laughs> one guy at the sheet of paper he goes have you got yours yet I'm like, excuse me, have you got yours? Yeah, what are you talking about? And that's his sales pitch. He's obviously, he gives you that leaflet and he goes, have you done yours yet? And you're like, what? You know, it's like you've lost something. You're like, no, I've not done mine yet. What is this? And that's when he falls into his speech. That was kind of clever and he wasn't very impressed by it. But I'm just thinking, you know, if we were to do something like that where we go up to people and we, you know, we approach them, we say, yo, you know, X, Y, Z. No, not the alphabet, but if we say something, if you ask a social question, They'll probably say, sorry, busy. I mean, I wouldn't say nine times out of 10, I'd say 19 times out of 20, they'd be not interested. Every now and again, you might get that weird person who says, you know, with, who has got nothing to do, or someone who is, has better social skills than me, uh, who will actually answer questions. Me personally, I'd rather not be disturbed. And I'm pretty sure looking at all these other people, I mean, I can see clipboards over there now. They're waiting for people to go past. Excuse me just a second, no, do one. That's what you always do. It's a natural reaction. You're only bothered. You know, you're either going to work or you're going to lunch or you're going home or you're doing something else. You don't want someone to ask you about your gas bills. And even if I didn't want my gas building, I'd just go on the internet. I'd find out online, find the cheapest deal and go there. There's not what everybody does. Why would, why would I need salespeople sitting around uh, Piccadilly Gardens saying, excuse me, is your boiler working? If not, here's Tesco's. No, thank you. These are like rants, aren't they? I'm like ranting for no reason. You know what? Let's do it. It's like social therapy. Like I said, you know, in the morning I was feeling kind of anxious, uh, having a really bad day. Spoke to a spoke to a person. I felt better again. You could be my therapist. Yeah. <laughs>